Engineer Man here. I'm doing a special video today where I'm going to put together a snake game from scratch in five minutes or less. We'll see how well that works out for me. There's really no time to waste. So let's do this. Okay, and begin. So first we need random and we need curses today. So we'll start by using curses to initialize the screen. From there, we can set the cursor to zero. That way it doesn't show up on the screen. After that, we need to get the width and the height from x, get max. We're going to create a new window using the height, the width, and starting it at the top left hand corner of the screen. We'll set it so it accepts keypad input and then refresh the screen every 100 milliseconds. We've got to create now our snake's initial position. So we'll start by doing that. The x will be the width of the screen divided by 4 and the y will be the height of the screen divided by 2, so a little bit left to center. So we'll create our initial snake body parts. So the first snake body part is going to be the y and then the x. So we'll need two more of those. And we'll do negative 2 and negative 1, which will be the body part one left and one left, one left and two left of the head. Now we've got to create the food. We'll just put the starting place for the food as the center of the screen. We we'll go ahead and add that food to the screen, and the food, of course, is going to be pie because next up pie. We have to tell our snake where he's going initially. We'll do that as key right. And then now we're going to start an infinite loop for every movement of the snake. So we have to store, we got to see what the next key is. And then we're going to set the key as key if next key equals one else next key. That'll give us either nothing or the next key. Now we gotta check to see if the person has lost the game, so they could lose the game if the Y position is either at the top or at the height of the screen, or if the X position is either to the left or the width of the screen, or you could lose if your snake is in itself. If any of these things happen, we're simply going to kill the window and quit. Great. From here, we got to determine what the new head of the snake is going to be. We'll start by taking the old head of the snake. That's our starting point. Here, we have to go ahead and figure out what the actual key being clicked is. Obviously, if it's a key down, we got to take the Y position and add one to it. So we'll copy this four more times. So we also have right, we have left, and we got up. Obviously, if it's up, we gotta go negative one. If it's left, we gotta go negative one as well. And if it's right, we go positive one on the x-axis. Great, once we've done that, we can insert the new head of our snake. From there, we're determining whether or not the snake has ran into the food. So in this case, if it runs into the food, we have to select a new piece of food. So we'll set food to none. We'll create a new food. From here, we're going to use rand int. And we'll do the height minus one to the height minus one. And one to the width minus one. That'll be our new food location. And now we're going to set food. We got to check to see if the food is nf if and if not in snake, else none. Say it's a none. If it's none, it's going to redo that loop. Forgot my thing there. And now we're going to go ahead and add that. Once the food has been selected, we're going to add it. And then again, we're doing curses.acs. Hi. From here, we're handling the else. we got to get the tail of the snake. So we'll Pop that off, run out of time here. And now we're gonna add a space in place of where the tail piece was. And then finally, in any case, we're adding the head of the snake to the screen using ACS CK board. I think we're done, let's test it out here. Nope, we got an error. New head is not defined. No problem, put an equal sign there.
fail is not defined. Fail, tail. And we got our snake game. Stop the clock. We can ride around, go get the piece of pie up here. Oh yeah, give me some pie. Run that around a little bit. Nice. And then it'll crash into itself. Nope. Okay, crashed. Now we're done. Now we're done. If you enjoyed this video, smash that like button. And if you want to see similar videos like this, happy to do them, they're fun, then tell me in the comments below so I know what I should do next. See you next time.